So here's a flock of uh, adult red shanks. Looks like they've freshly arrived from the breeding grounds. Maybe some of them oversummered further south of the breeding grounds. Maybe they've been here the whole summer. And you can see a variety of plumages. There's a very dark one there in the middle, breeding plumage bird. Um, but uh, regardless of the sort of coloration of them, you can see that these birds are very... the, the plumage is ragged and uh, kind of moth-eaten um, because they're all at different... I mean, the, the, the feathers are generally worn and different ages, but if you look at the bird at the back here, right at the back, walking, walking to the right, you'll notice something very different. All the feathers on this bird seem to be the same age. They're not, uh, there's not some older than others or some newer than others, and they're all remarkably fresh. And so this tells us this bird at the back here is a juvenile. Now, you'll see all the feathers are lined up neatly in, in neat rows um, because they're so fresh and also because juvenile feathers are slightly smaller than adult feathers so they seem to fit better onto the wing onto the back so you see this neat pattern of feathers all lined up in nice neat rows compared to the adults at the front which are kind of just a, a real ragtag mess of worn feathers, some stripy, some plain, some pale, some dark. Um, so that's the easiest way to tell an adult from a juvenile is just to look at the state of the feathers, especially at this time of year when birds have just arrived from the breeding grounds. So the bird at the back, every feather neat, the same shape, same age, nicely patterned. Birds at the f that's a juvenile. Birds at the front, worn, uh, worn out looking, ragged. You can see the bird immediately in front of the juvenile, facing to the right, just sleeping. See this sort of a very worn state of the scapulars and coverts, those pale stripy tertials which look, look very bleached. Maybe some fresh coverts coming through, but different age and looking very the worse for wear. So that's the easiest way to tell a juvenile from an adult. Look at the state of the feather wear.